Hi, welcome to Lessons with John. Today is uh, we're going to try Ba Ba Black Sheep. Ba. Okay. You're going to need a D chord on the guitar for this one. All right. So third string, second fret, second string, third fret, first string, second fret. Get rid of the sixth string with your thumb. That's my D chord, my G chord. Sixth string, third fret, fifth string, second fret, first string, third fret. If you do your G chords different, don't worry about it. It's fine. Nice simple song. A7, I'm going to go 4th string 2nd fret, 2nd string 2nd fret. And I'm going to meet that 6th string. So 3 chords, that's all you need for uh, for this song. Alright, it's in 2-4 times, so it's a little different. Uh, so it's, I'm going to I'm gonna do like a down, down, up, I think. Uh, you might catch me going boom, down, up. So sometimes I'll do that, like I'll use the bass note. On the D chord, the bass note would be the 4th string open. On the G chord, it would be the 6th string, and on the A7, it's the 5th string open. So if you hear me doing that, that's, that's, that's all I'm doing. I'm just following the, you know, the chord changes using that bass note. So, uh, but, uh, you know, you could just go, you could just strum the D like this. That's also fine, you know, but you might, you might hear me doing it. And I might not even realize I'm doing it, okay? So, you do two measures of D. For one, and then back to D, A7 for one, D for one, A7 for one, D for one, and that is the whole song right there. Uh, it just keeps repeating over and over again. So you got, you, uh, I'll, I'll play it without yakking here, so. That's it. Uh, so it's a D chord for two measures. G chord for one, back to D for one, A7 for one, D for one, A7 for one, D for one, and that just keeps repeating over and over again. Um, and that's literally it. So these are nice, simple songs. Um, please subscribe, uh, any comments down below, and uh, play more guitar. Bye.